fit you know, green green shirts. Has John ever chosen another shirt color? I don't think so. I think he likes green. I'm gonna ask and then reserve his favorite color is green. Gain the bounce. Gain the oh okay. Thank thank you, Ghost yep. of Devin. Uh, gain the bounce right off this right off from the from the uh, special menu. Right, and that's gonna be really crucial in this in this matchup because we know how much John Numbers likes to use those sun salutations, Kaboom. those headers. Oh my God, he almost comboed off Kaboom. I yeah, Kaboom lost is. It. Yeah. Oh, oh my God, there's so much going on. So what happened was using Fame Patch was this Frame Six move. It knocked John Numbers off to his other side of the stage after getting almost like you yeah, said the Kaboom off of uh, uh, almost getting the fear off of the Kaboom. Psych him off. Offline, uh, just barely tagging John Numbers' shield. That's the only thing you got to get the trade off you get with uh, Psycho is that if you get hit, if, if it hits shoot, it's gone. I'm surprised he actually didn't do an up throw right there, but it likely wouldn't have killed, which I completely understand. Yeah, probably not. Probably just wanted stage positioning instead. But with that, that F tilt. Slide in F tilt. Not gonna get it. Not quite, but another Psych up on deck, and now really most things will kill. That is just Even, regular F, uh, yep, F tilt. Yeah. Even a non psych up one. Oh! There's something that's, that's kind of funny. <laughs> Getting yes. deep breathing, got, got that zoom coming up. Five places where zoom can it be. Good guess. Yeah, got one five chest guessing where Almost he was going to land. It. Getting that right, uh, up the there. It's not quite getting Zappo, but not getting the. What? So yeah. Lily, him going a little bit down with shield, didn't, uh, didn't allow numbers to grab him. It's really funny. Yeah, no, Vivi's uh, spacing has been so good so far. But finally, almost getting a punish off of the Zapple, but just waited a little bit too long on that F, F smash. Not going to be finding it. Maybe oh, that's attackable. Yep. Waited on the ledge just a little bit too long. And now, John numbers with the buffs of his own with the uh, the deep breathing. I think it's actually very funny that both of these characters can like just buff themselves up to boss levels. Yeah, but, but the thing about Hero is that he has two of them, theoretically. Oof and Psycho. And Accelerado. And, and Accelerado, yes. Bounce. If you want to think about and Accelerado, I was thinking about like more like the power of, of deep breathing and comparing it to Oof and Psycho. And she's like, you know what, you're right. You have big speed and you have literally negates every projectile for half the cast. Ooh, oh my god, I'm surprised that the, the low, very outer hitbox of Kaboom didn't actually catch numbers uh, outside of his air dodge. Yeah, and now we're seeing John numbers with a percent lead. Ooh, just barely missed that dash attack, but Vivi not Stretch finding a punch. <laughs> not the top. Stretch those shoulders. Stretch those shoulders and get headed. And John Numbers has been thrown out quite a few taunts this uh, this top top eight. I love how they just oh my god, Sizzle was just out of reach. I feel like that always happens. It's never it's never there. It's always just out of reach. Great parry. But he's really off stage now. He had zoom, but chose to go for Sizz instead. Uh, might be a little interesting. I think he was trying to uh, make get, get numbers off of the ledge so he can safely recover with Kaswoosh. And actually, the ending, like the fire uh, lag of um, of Sizz, actually caught numbers right underneath anyway. So it kind of worked out anyway the way that he wanted to. And he was able to come back with Kaswoosh. He did he did enough MP for that. But you know, he doesn't have any, any MP for uh, all these antics he has to do. Come on. Yeah, no, John, John's been playing with so much confidence right now, just coming in with the walks. Really just not scared of Vivi's options right now. I'm telling you, I, I feel like Numbers has finally been kind of uh, playing a little bit of a different game recently. He's been playing, that's, that, that's it. But he's been playing a lot more, uh, not even patient, just actually getting on the stage. Like, <laughs> it sounds funny saying like that, like he started on the ledges, like he's crawling, now he's walking, like oh my god. <laughs> Like now he's not afraid of actually getting on the stage and uh, and actually playing the game the way that you know, oh, he played. That down smash is so evil. VV just barely misspaced. He had the read uh, to get John Numbers to roll from ledge there, but just barely misspaced the F tilt. John Numbers absolutely gonna take an opening like that. Oh, that's some serious music. I, <laughs> it's probably Tekken. If I had to guess. It's probably Tekken. It sounds like Tekken. All right, Vivi coming in with the Luminary counter pick, switching up skins. Yeah, so uh, Vivi Tech told me this. He says that he ha he feels like if he loses one skin, he'll change the other one, and he'll f it it'll be better. It it it's the RNG with the skins, I, I promise. So we have Mixed Luminary on deck right now. 
with this other auto again. No, nothing off the the up tilt. Oh, you, okay. Wow. You got something. I think. Yeah. Kafir's might not have been as optimal, but you know it's safe. You don't risk running into Chan numbers as up smash. Yeah, because I, I, that hitbox, I know I haven't seen it, but I know it's nasty. Uh, I don't know. I just know. It's it's got some some wonky side hitboxes. Exactly. Pressure by John numbers, looking almost Lucario esque with the uh, the B reverse movement into a grab. Oh Ooh. my god, he's been he's been going for that a lot more often, and Numbers was, was a little bit out of space away from the Thwack, where it, it likely would not have, with knowing BB's luck, um, unfortunately, it likely would not have actually resulted in the uh, instant KO. Numbers waiting on ledge, waiting for BB to get back on stage, and kind of using time to um, get deep breathing back up, get a little bit more of his health replenished. <laughs> oh! Oh! Do it! Do it! Hatchet, hatchet man! Oh! It's okay! Crit! 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 Oh my god! Who oh needs, my god! Who needs Hatchet Man's guaranteed crit oh when god. you can just get... God bless Amen. <laughs> we finally saw BB crit. Put that in the tally, please, and thank you. Hey. If you're, if you're uh, keeping up with your Xeno Weekly bingo, uh, BB critting. BB crit... BB critting was not... No! <laughs> BB critting was not on my Xeno Weekly bingo, but you know what also was on my Xeno Weekly bingo? BB getting hit by a believe it was like... Oh yeah. Yep. Get hit and getting his stock taken away just like that. But numbers at 60%, very, very, you know, not that bad actually. I was gonna say very scary, but not really. Numbers can really bring it out with deep breathing as well. Such good use of the accelerator to threaten so much space. John Numbers really couldn't commit to wow. anything because of how much space that VB could cover. All right. Sun Salutation catching oh, that scary. neutral get up, and John Numbers is taking it all the way to the bank, bringing this right back to even. <laughs> Kaboom <laughs> is a little bit better. Kaboom is such a scary move because it, it, it doesn't have a fixed distance, so unquote. Like, it can go shorter or further depending on if the, if they, if the character gets hit in like the little, um, little, little guy coming out first. Yeah. That's why it was so close to numbers. And that up, that up to uh, psych up, up, up tilt. definitely going to take it. And th I think that heal actually oh. came in clutch, uh, keeping Vivi from dying to that up there. Yes, he does do a lot, about 11% uh, recovery for yourself, for your percentage. So that probably did do a little bit. Kuhn gained that uh, Zappo off on the ledge. I want to see if we're going to get another Zap. No, nothing. Here, I would have snoozed! I would have snoozed right there and been evil. Ooh, good timing by John Numbers, catching uh, Vivi on the zoom. But John Numbers is starting to get to these scary percents, and Vivi still has a whole fresh stock to play around with. If it even comes to that. Yeah, I really want to see a lot of uh, do it. Oh, I would have yeah. held it. Got yeah, Bang coming out, not getting the first jab. Another zoom. John oh, was scary. actually taking the time to deep breathing, but the zoom placement was actually just unfavorable enough for John Numbers that he wasn't able to finish off that deep breathing. Oh my he God. is able to finish off VB's second stock, though. Yeah. Uh, almost 100% on John right now. But, I mean, that's a deep breathing combo and a half. Completely agree. We have, like, God, I, I would just... I would just go for a thwack. That's just funny. It's so funny. It's such a funny little move. Vivi's, <laughs> Vivi's thrown out everything, thrown out but everything. The kitchen, everything but the kitchen sink right now. Oh, my God. <laughs> but, I mean, that's a lot of mana gone. Uh, almost 70. Well, thankfully, man, it does recover. And does, oh, nice back air right there. there we jumping. Go. Catching Numbers' jump out of the kaboom from sh out of shield and getting the back air. And, mm, beautiful. There's actually a moment where Numbers. Yeah, right here. We have Numbers jumping, catching that back air right off the top platform. And that yeah. definitely will be it for Numbers at like 130 something. Wanted to. Uh, John wanted to put. Yikes, that, <laughs> that was, was funny. so funny. And then. Beautiful. Mm. That's good. Oh, then numbers is good. He's like, what? Crit? <laughs> Never gets a crit. <laughs> I was just talking about BB, but there's like, you don't get crits, bro. But every time I pick up the controller, it's crit time. <laughs> I guess that just makes you the better player. No, 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 no. <laughs> Take that back. That literally untrue. <laughs> I just got dumb RNG because I'm bad at the game. But you know who's not bad? These two, these two right here going to game three. Uh, VV over 20% basically from like literally F to like. <laughs> you know, just we fit trainer things. Just we fit things. Alright, playing a lot at this ledge so far. Uh, 
Uh oh, you got Nair. Uh -oh. Okay, not too much, not Ooh. too much of a punish. Uh, that could have been really Vimu detrimental. Vimu was at kind of an awkward percentage to uh, continue the combo, so John just not able to find it. Getting the heal. That was very smart on uh, on Vivi actually to use Bang as a way to kind of come in with a jab. He didn't get it, but it's very smart. He should keep it. He should do it again, honestly. Vivi uh, actually getting the other heal, which does mean that heal is off the yep. table for uh, the rest of this stock. You only get two. Two first stock. If you take the stock. These are weird uh, scramble situations. Uh, not too much coming out of it. Um, that might be the wave, yeah. though. Just like uh, be reversing into Kafriz. Like, let's go. Yeah, I think Numbers was uh, trying to find some sort of rhythm throwing out the Sun Salutation, but uh, Vivi's projectile was just a little bit stronger. Yeah, I think he was actually waiting there for a little bit too long. It wasn't expecting anything to happen, but completely forgot that like, first was on deck and charged up and ready to go. Yeah, and I mean, it's, I, I don't disagree with John's decision because of the position that he was in. You know, the small battlefield or Pokemon Stadium platforms really enable this sort of uh, projectile play so well because it forces an air approach. It blocks off so many angles that the opponent can approach from. But, I mean, it doesn't matter when you just have a lawnmower projectile like the Frizz. Using the the, the shield to basically negate some citation is a very smart play on VV. No time to waste any MP on bounce. You can just shield and literally shield. Yeah, you're, like you said, a lot of just kind of straight hits coming in. I haven't seen really any uh, straight combos like we did earlier uh, with uh, the Nair from... You can make it with Kiss Rouge. But you oh, can't make it with Untackable uh, Header. That. Coming down with the Kaboom. Literally Divi's behavior. That's so disrespectful. I love it. Divi's got some... Divi's got some uh, Yugi RNG coming out right now. He's pulling the heart of the cards for those Kabooms. Where he, he's believing in the heart of the special menu. And not getting jab or grab. And John basically bringing us back to an even game pretty, pretty consistently. Yeah, but I mean, it all comes down to if he can take that stock. I mean, I saw a lot of on deck. Giving Hero basically more jump, more speed. Giving, making him pretty much the fastest character in the game. Yeah, Literally faster than Sonic. It is going to be harder for... Uh, How'd you carry it? <laughs> It's going to be harder for John to find these these stocks while Vivi's got Accelerottle or even Bounce. And it's it's just going to make it all the more easy for Vivi to find the stocks instead. But Accelerottle and Bounce offline now. But Psych Up is now online. All we're going to we're, we're, we're gonna see from Vivi fishing is likely an up throw kill, a, a up throw kill, or a fo uh, F throw kill. Yeah. That was a very scary situation for Vivi being Almost stuck no on kill. that platform. Some Salutation not taking it quite yet. Does find the zoom. John Numbers has... He had some Salutation, I believe, but didn't use it. Oh, oh catches the roll, but oh, another... But still coming back. Yeah, just across the stage, Vivi is able to hold on to his stock and still has Psych Up on deck. John has to be careful. John's being very careful, making sure not to... Not, just to barely outspace Vivi. Unless he's coming in for a throw, just like with that fourth throw right there. Oh, but that fourth throw is going to do it. Yep. Gonna do it. Yeah, no, John, John, like you were saying, John was playing so smart, not giving Vivi any of those opportunities to anti air like yep. he wants to with the, the up tilt. Okay, bounce now on deck. Uh, going to be making it a little bit harder for John to find this stock, especially when Vivi's coming in with these accelerated jabs. And that's horrifying, honestly. The jab one two, very great combo starter for a lot of hero mains. And right now we have like VV at one sixty six percent, getting a little bit of a heal going for himself, and not getting hit by the dash, but not getting killed by the dash attack. But we'll get killed by the up to up air from uh, pre 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 the, pl the placement of zoom is so important. All right, and another uh, game three fresh stock. Uh, a fresh last stock situation. We've been seeing this so much in top eight so far. These very close sets. And yeah, not even just top eight. Rest of the bracket, lots of them are going to like uh, uh, up to game three. So it's 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 very stacked today. The Zeno and what's also stacked is how scary that this is the last game for both players before one of them gets sent inevitably into the hell that is losers. I know, and I mean it's a testament to how. How patient and consistent these players are playing. Oh. What? Whoa! <laughs> wait, wait, no, because I'm sorry. We got we got the replay, right? We got the replay of that, okay? 
Okay, okay great. Thank you. <laughs> so right before we do all that, let me talk about what just happened with that soccer ball being literally a third player. Uh, we have VV, one hundred and fifty percent, really scarce he's for himself. Any, any really anything of, of what uh, numbers does will close it out for him, unless VV is able to get a thwack. Ah, okay, just a thwack, a psychic, a oomph, something going on for him. I'll be careful. Right, another zoom. He's been pulling these zooms so well. All right, jab, getting John off of him. And another jab. Another one. Do it again. See, now this is what we're gonna need. Okay. We're gonna need VV to do some kind of up tilt or up throw situation. Going right back. Wow, that RNG is bad. VV Going might right be, same spot. Might might be looking for oomph, actually. Looking for maybe a shield break. It'd be really funny if he got a shield break on John Numbers. Oh, this might be... No, not quite, not quite. No, no deep breathing on deck. But now it is. Ah! F tilt is going to okay. be taking it. Okay, production. We have to go back to that wherever, wherever <laughs> happened right there. Because you were talking, I was listening, and then that happened, and then you screamed, and I was like, no, there's no way. I okay. felt like I blacked out when it happened. It, 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 uh, it was. It, we'll, we'll find it. Do not worry, everyone. We will find this because it was. I think it was after uh, this kill. It was nasty. All I know is that soccer ball came down, bobbed Vivi, I think twice, and then numbers did a uh, up air. Yeah, I think I think this was the interaction. Right here, here it comes. Oh, you got it? Yeah. So Vivi tried doing dash tag, doinked him, and then no, <laughs> no, no numbers. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're gonna show you right now. We're gonna show you this interaction. Whack. So we're gonna go quarter time. The he ball comes up. The soccer ball too, and it just put it in a worse position for Boom, him. Boom, bam. Oh yeah, I thought I did, but now I've seen the replay. It just it just hit yeah. once, and then the back the back hit of your. Yeah, it's still combo started. Okay. Right. Oh yeah, no, it, it didn't hit twice. I, I thought it did, and then seeing it, I saw that it hit the ball hit him once, and then your. Yeah. Right. Yeah, it didn't get a second hit. I thought I got scared. I was like, "There's, there's no way." It, it was all just a blur. It you was know? so scary. I, I, we all. Were